comparing and ordering decimals. So let's start. So first we'll learn about comparing decimals. If the whole number is different, here we have an example. 532.48 and 682.26. If the whole number is different, 682.26 will be correct, will be greater. If the whole number is same, the whole number is same, we will take the decimal part. Whichever is greater will be greater. Over here, 42.68 is greater in decimal part, so it will be greater among the two. Now, which is greater among these? Can you tell me? 5.473 or 5.474? It will be 5.474. But here we we'll learn how to use these steps. So the first step is to copy the numbers vertically with the decimal points aligned. For example, it will be 5.473, 5.474. The step 2 will be comparing the whole numbers. If they match, then we have to move on to the next digit. 5 and 5 match. So you have to go to the new digit, next digit. Now step 3 is to compare the digit in the 10th place. If they match, then move on to the next digit again. And now the 10th digit is 4, so they both match. Step 4. Compare the digits in 100th place. Because they match, they move to the next digit. And the 7 and 7 match, they move to the next digit. The last and final step is to compare the digit in the 1000th place. And these do not match. They, we compare those digits. 3 and 4. As we already know, 4 is bigger than 3. Therefore, 5.474 is greater than 5.473. So we have to note that before conversion, we have to make all the decimal numbers like decimals. Now, let's learn about the ascending order of decimals. The ascending order means ordering numbers from smallest to largest. How do we do that? First step is to look at the digit left for the decimal. We have to orient them small to large, then dense place, again small to large, and then hundred place, which is small to large, and we have to go on four. For the example one, we have 0 0.24, 0 0.35, and 0 0.25. So the ascending order of this will be 0 0.24, 0 0.25, and 0 0.35. The second example is 7.51, 7.39, 7.31, and 8.47. So the ascending order of this will be 7.31, 7.39, 7.51, and 8.47. Now let's learn about the descending order of decimals. Descending order and ascending order are totally opposite. So descending order will be ordering numbers from the largest to smallest. As we already know the steps of ascending order of decimals, we will not discuss more about this. Only the difference is that in ascending order, it will be small to large. Descending order, it will be large to small. So we have to first look at the digits of the less order decimal, then ten place, then hundred place, and so on. For the third example will be 1.87, 0 0.85, and 1.02. So the descending order is equal to 1.87, 1.02, and 0 0.85. The last example will be 4.45, 4.66, 4.40, and 5.41. So the descending order will be 5.41, 4.66, 4.45, and 4.40. So what did we learn today? We learned how to compare decimals. The two conditions were comparing decimals, the ascending order and descending order, ascending order decimals, and descending order decimals. So if you like the video, please like, share, subscribe, and hit on the notification bell to get more videos like this.